and welcome to Decorate Your Life. This is an easy DIY shaker car tutorial. You don't have fusing tools, you don't have expensive acetate paper, you don't have expensive mounting tape. Well, guess what? Neither do I. And this is how I pulled it off. For this project, I'm going to be using an empty pocket letter sleeve that I have for my stash. I'm going to use one of my spellbinder dies and I'm just going to use a regular plain thank you card that I have. And I will be speeding up the video so that you can see my entire process in a short amount of time. And if you don't have a die cutting machine, you can always make yourself a template so that you can draw a window around your card and cut it with an X-Acto knife. And you can construct your shaker part by simply cutting around your pocket letter sleeve. And just make sure that you cut as close to the pocket as you possibly can without nipping the seal. Once you are satisfied with your shaker pocket, you will use regular scotch tape to close the opening. Since this is the only window die that I have, I'm going to be using it in an invert position so as to cut an opening into the cardstock. And of course, I will use my washi tape for easy removal later on. And now that I have my window opening, I will neatly attach the shaker pocket onto the card. I will now cut the inside panels and attach them to my shaker card. And for this part, I will be using my double-sided tape.
Since this shaker card is of a modern shabby chic style, I will be spraying some adhesive in a well ventilated area so that I can attach the lace to the card. Now what you see me doing is playing around with the paper. I'm just trying to make up my mind as to what the final look will be to this modern shabby chic shaker card. And the girl stamp is one of my prima doll stamps in which I paper pieced and colored and attached it with a 3D pop dots onto the card. So what do you think of my method in creating these shaker cards? If you want to take a crack at it, go ahead and tag me on your videos. I would love to see your work. Thank you so very much for watching. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. I will see you again soon. Bye.